Hey guys, welcome back to Season 2 of The Dave Shadell Show. I'm CJ, and Dave's got a great lineup for today. We've got Shadoos and Shadon'ts, and he's going to be talking to two guys who are in a play in Perf Hall later this month. Dave? Well guys, we're back, and it is Season 2. Thanks for the introduction, CJ. Today, since Season 2 is kicking up, I figured why not double down on everything? So I went out and got two of my favorite people from the upcoming play in Perf Hall, The Man Who Came to Dinner. I pulled some strings, and I was able to get the man himself, and his doctor. So guys, thanks for being here. We have Wilbur Mock, the man, and Alex Schaefer, the doctor. Wilbur, tell us a little bit about this play. What is it? Well, it is a hysterical comedy about a celebrity radio star who comes to this dinner that he's invited to, breaks his hip, and has to stay for a long time. He's very popular, so he has all of his celebrity friends come, and they're all characters, very flamboyant and just all over the place. He also gets all sorts of gifts and things like that, like some penguins, an octopus, you know, just all sorts of different things. And nice. it's, it's really quite funny. Huh. And so you're one of the celebrity friends? No, no, no. I'm playing his doctor. <laughs> oh. He his hip, so. uh, but like you said, he gets a lot of celebrity friends that come by, but yeah. he also gets a lot of annoying crackpots in the town as well, and the doctor is just one of those. Are you an annoying people. crackpot? Of course. <laughs> yeah, he randomly just pops his head and goes, oh, yeah. hello, Mr. Whiteside. He's always <laughs> looking for him. Climbing always in windows. His attention. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So tell me a little bit more about the play. Is this kind of like our standard? Well, it's in Perf Hall, right? Yes, mm -hmm. it's in Perf Hall, and it's a, lot, it's a lot different than all the other oh, okay. things that's in Perf Hall. It actually has a really large cast, yeah. a cast of 20, 21 to 23 yeah. people. Yeah, it's very big. Mm -hmm. And um, well, the history is also super interesting because all the characters are actually based off people in Hollywood oh. during the time. The writers wrote about most of their friends into, they wrote their <laughs> friends into the play, basically. So uh -oh. they, they based the main character off one of their friends and he, according to what I've read up on the play, he actually came unannounced to one of their um, houses and then just sort of terrorized all the guests and everything That's and then fantastic. just left. Yeah, so that's kind of what they based it <laughs> off of. So it's like a semi-true, terrible story. Yeah, semi-true. Yeah. Yeah, semi yeah. All right, so when is this and when can I get tickets? Well, I can't get tickets, I'm in Of course. Well, but <laughs> Well, tickets are coming out on October 1st, uh, and the last week of October will be the production date, so that's the 24th to the 29th. Sweet. All right, guys, you heard it here. The man who came to dinner, it's going to be great. So we've got a couple of shadows and shadowns with these guys coming right up after the break. All right, so should do's and should don'ts for staying at someone's house. Uh, should do, ask for the Wi-Fi password. Should don't, ask for their Netflix password. Should do, make yourself at home. Should don't, make yourself too at home. Should do, compliment the food and eat it. Should don't, drink the milk right out of the jug. Should do, enjoy the extra time you have with friends and family. Should don't, overstay your welcome. So Dave, what else do you have for us? Okay, um, actually that's all we have guys. That's the end of this week's episode. So remember, tickets, October 1st. The play, the end of October. The title, The Man Who Came to Dinner. Be there and you're gonna have a great time. Thanks so much for watching guys.